morning and welcome back to my channel it's your girl my Mwena. so i am going to the market not actually to the market to the shop and i just wanted to take you and show you the shop right now where we are staying there are no like shops like no big shop the only shop that is here is like two minutes three minutes away though it's a mad shop so i just wanted to show you so that you may be able to see see let me just go by then i tell you something what is happening in kenya right now so probably that is a bad reason as to why i was not posting oh my god it is closed the shop that i was going to but now it is closed so this is the shop that i was going to and now it is closed so we have to go to somewhere called market center hopefully i'll be able to find let us go there i do not have a breakfast so weird since that shop over there is closed so now i have to go to a place called center the center is a it's like very far from where we stay it's quite a distance but we are going to go and uh buy actually i've not even told you what you're going to buy this is uh kenyan shillings it's like 50 shillings that is um not five uh probably f five ah, no, i can't get the math right i'm sorry about that yeah so it's 50 shillings probably 0 0.5 dollars yeah so let me just show you the homesteads so that you may be able basically how most of the houses looks like here in the village there are mud mud houses thatched houses as you can see yeah but this side also you can see let me just show you give you a clear view so this is the this is the road that leads to the center as you can see that small there is a school i don't know if you can see it yeah so it's a school and then i did also a video here on this hotel over here it's called villa, villa rosa if you haven't seen that video kindly go and watch it so hopefully we'll be able to find her i don't want to reach like after but hopefully we'll be able to find a shop somewhere over here oh i don't like that Sasa, uko na majani? Hapa. Hauna majani. Santa ni hapa juu. Okay. Yo. Sasa, uko na majani? Nisaidie. Ah, uko na ngapi na ngapi? It's a day you are such. Thank you. I've made it. I've bought uh, tea leaves. This is how it looks like. The tea leaves that I've bought. Yeah, so this is how it looks like. This one goes for 30 shillings. So I've remained with some coin here. As you can see, 20 shillings. Yes, yeah, so. I just wanted to spend the day with you together because uh, last week I only posted once, which is so bad of me. But I did that. I can define myself for that. But I don't like to give you what do you call it reasons like bad reasons as to why I'm not posting. So the reason why I did not post is that uh, for the past two weeks there's been like protest.
people protesting like those are you see each and every there's something called the financial year so the financial year for kenya is basically from june june let's say june 2024 to june 2025 so they wrote um the finance bill for this year and let me tell you these people were going to overtax us like if you had an ancestral an ancestral lad you have to pay so that you may be able to have that many things like cars uh, you have to pay tax on it based on the value of the car things like there's something called a colevy for just breathing you have to pay and let's say for example what else made kenyans very mad so like we call themselves they call themselves djensis so they decided they decided that how do i put it they decided that he's not going to overtax us the president is not going to overtax us for no good reason so he people people formed like a riot group he did not have a leader he did not have a political leader or a tribal leader it's just the youth that just came out and they were like enough is enough we want our country back we want good leadership we want accountability we want all these beautiful things for ourselves so people literally they how do you call it all these things were arranged on x on twitter and then so they'll put like hashtag on hashtag occupy state house or hashtag occupy occupy parliament or hashtag occupy cbd cbd is basically the central business uh i don't know what the d stands for but in nairobi so people came out they were protesting for their rights then all of a sudden the police started shooting and let me tell you there was this so oh, this child who was like eight years eight i don't know 12 years old who was shot 12 times like 12 fucking times and you can just imagine what's up with our country kenya so that is what even made people mad more mad so that is what made people like extremely mad so they went again to the streets and people were being shot especially when you like formed that how the thing people were being abducted so people are literally being abducted for just wanting wanting something for yourselves yeah so that is what has been happening in our country and people are mad so today is also on a tuesday there's supposed to be a protest today so i'm not sure but um in town where i live people have already like arranged stones and my sister was like don't go to town oh it's bad so yeah so that is what has been happening in our country it's a revolutionary for gen z yeah so it has been like a very sad two weeks because people are lost and then uh, let me get to the house and then continue the story then um how do i put it um then how do i put it then there was a massacre i don't know if people were just nini naendelea what's going on guys what's going on what's going on what's going on what's going on guys jana all we had were bottles of water manze that's all we had bottles of water na two cards literally na mask that's that that's that, that's all we had but these guys are killing us now tell us about this this tell us about this bill no tell us because there is clearly something we don't know no 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 tell us why do you guys want to pass it so bad Mama Mboka is being shot. I just saw a guy who was shot like 10 times. Guys, 10 times. 10 times. 10. 10. At the 1, 2, 3, 10. <laughs> Whoa. What, what, what's going on, guys? What's, hey, yeah. what's going on? Tuko Eragani, what's going on? Now we are the criminals, us. Criminals, tunatembea na maji, literally just, just, just water. We were even helping soldiers with, with water. And we are the criminals, all we have, mask. Yeah, ish. Kai. Short at night. Out of nowhere, the police that is shooting, those are Mama Mboga. Mama Mboga is basically a woman who sells uh, groceries. So they were shot at, kids, 
it was such a bad week last week but we thank god for the new week now hopefully everything just becomes beautiful so basically that is what has been happening in kenya yeah i don't know if i should do like a detailed video on it but let me just tell you you have to be afraid because you don't know who they'll come for next so yeah but anyways that was that what, what has been happening in our country kenya mbako masijapata huko juu nini bread huko niambia hiyo ni 30 nine twenty just to finish on the story and on the video because i don't want it to be so long is that um the president finally got a chance to drop the bill and it was rejected like officially officially it was rejected so there's no finance bill and uh, everything right now is back to normal not but there's some tension there's some tension because people still want like more they want there's something called house levy they also want it to be dropped they want like a lot of things to be dropped so um, there are some people who are still in talks with the government the church the church let me tell you that protest united kenyans let me tell you uh how do you call it the church came along um all these uh, Non, non governmental organizations they came along there's some people who were just giving out free medical medical what do you call it free medical camp for them yeah free medical assistance for them then there are some people who are giving water food for those who went out to protest then later on when those people those people who were shot were taken to like it's called Kenyatta National Hospital Kenyans also came along and like they contributed over four million so that these people can just be treated and be discharged so that is how organized we were and that is how not talking about that thing it really makes me feel like crying because let me tell you last week we were watching like live on tv we show people being we yeah we show we saw people being shot dead on tv and they'll just be there it was so bad and um the people were also protesting they got a chance to um, to occupy parliament and they burnt uh some uh a bit of parliament yes also where the governor the city council it's called the city council where basically the governor so the head of the county kenya is divided into counties so the head of the county is called a governor so where the governor office is located was also banned so last week it was just out of the world but we thank god we came out of it yeah so there are some people who are still in the hospital and uh, there are some people who have been discharged and uh, gone on but wow it was such a bad sight but we thank god because the bill was finally dropped and um yeah so i don't know I don't know what will happen today. I think that today you'll be able to see the video, but I'll give you an update maybe in the next video. Okay. Yeah, uh, so that is what has been happening and uh, I really thank God we are past that. Yeah. So that is it from me. I think this is where I learned my video so that I may be able to start like another video properly. <laughs> I wanted to do like a proper video. So on it but because i got this chance let me just do it and finish it yeah so that is what happened in our country kenya but right now we thank god everything is back to normal everything is peaceful yeah so that is it from me guys make sure you like subscribe and share and if you want a detailed video on what really happened kindly drop a comment let's have a conversation in the comment section and if you're kenyan watching this and you think that i left something or i said something wrong kindly correct me in the comment section yeah so make sure you like subscribe and share and see you in the next video adios muchachos peace see you in my next video bye yeah and for the people who are used to their videos i'm sorry <laughs> okay